Leah asked me to uh, put a few notes together, um, try not to talk too much about a, a football team that's in Columbus. So I, I put a few notes together for everybody. This is the only paper I could find. Go Bucks. Leah said, you know, I want to introduce you to this guy. He's a nice guy. Can you try to be nice? And I said, I always try to be nice. I always, always try it. But Andy comes up to me, um, looks me in the eye, very impressive, shakes my hand, very impressive. I'm like, okay, this guy's pretty good. Very respectful, uh, communicates well. He's an all right looking guy. I mean, you know. So he's got a lot of things going for him. I know Leo's real, really into him. So we talk sports. Yeah, that's where it goes wrong a little bit. So he went down a couple pegs, but you know what? He takes a good beating because I, I rip him as about as hard as you can. And he just keeps coming back with a smile and, and a joke and a, a cheers with a bourbon glass. Um, we appreciate that. And Andy, you're, you're a great guy. And we, we really look forward to um, you being in the family. Appreciate that. Raise a glass or a flask or whatever you have to Andy and Leah. We look forward to the next chapter in your life. Cheers. Leah, I can't believe our day is finally here. There has been so much anticipation leading up to this day, and I'm so happy to finally marry you. From the moment I met you, I knew there was something special and it felt so different. When you said, I hear you are my future husband, there was something inside of me that paused and felt like I knew that would come true. I always had a sense from that moment on that you would someday be my wife. From separate cities, to roommates, to owning our first home together, it's everything I ever wanted and I'm so happy to have it with you. I am so lucky to have fallen in love with you. You are beautiful inside and out, and God certainly answered my prayers with you. You are the best person I know, and the reasons I love you grow every day. No matter what difficult time we may have, I will always love you. There is no force on earth that can't break the bond we have with one another. I will always be here to care for you and support you, and I will never leave your side. You are all I have ever wanted and all I've ever needed. Marrying you is the best decision I have and ever will make in my life. You are my whole world, and I can't wait for the future we will build together. You are going to make the absolute best mother and dog mom, and I can't wait to be with you every step of the way. I love you so much, and I can't wait to celebrate what is going to be the most amazing day with you. You deserve all the happiness in the world, and I promise to give you that. I can't wait to finally call you my wife. I'll see you at the altar with all my love. I, Andy, take you, Leah, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honor you all the days of my life. I, Leah, take you, Andy, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honor you all the days of my life. She's always worn her heart on her sleeve. Um, so when she told me that she met someone, I couldn't help but be a little protective. But when I met Andy for the first time, all this seemed to go away. It's Andy, I could not have pictured a more perfect person for Leah, really. God created you for her, and I am so happy that you guys have met, honestly. Um, I have absolutely no doubts that you guys will have a long and happy marriage because if you guys can plan a wedding during this awful pandemic, then you guys can make it through anything. So I really truly believe in you guys. You guys are truly meant for each other. And I love you both. So please lift up your glass. 
and cheers to the bride and groom. From the moment I met you, I knew you were different than any man I've ever met before. You treated me like every woman dreams of being treated. Thank you for always putting me first. Thanks for always having my best interest in mind. Thank you for being the absolute best man for me. I love you so much and cannot wait to finally marry you today and officially become the Declan. Love you forever, my booby. Love, Flea. But we shared a room, I mean, groom, room, yeah. Growing up, um, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> just kidding, we shared a room growing up. So you can only imagine, if you know Leah, you can only imagine some of the stuff I went through with her. Like I'd be looking for a shirt one day to go to school. I'd ask her if she'd seen it, of course she'd say no. I'd see her later in the hallway and she has that shirt on. Yeah, so that's kind of how my life went. Or she'd be trying to embarrass me, taking pictures of me at night, um, wearing my headgear for braces, <laughs> which I never wore again after that. They're just a great match, and I have uh, no doubt that they're going to enjoy every moment together for, for a lifetime here. Um, well, I should say maybe not every moment because, you know, growing up with Andy, uh, we, we just did multiple family vacations, and I always got put in the same room as Andy. And I can tell you, the snoring is out of control. So I feel for you there, Leah, but uh, every other moment I'm sure you guys will, will definitely enjoy. Uh, so, so with that, I'm, I'm going to end this speech with just, uh, you know, one of Andy's least favorite things, and that's giving some older brother advice. So, uh, you know, life, life can often be like this in this COVID pandemic. It's unpredictable. It's, uh, it's, it's challenging, and um, things don't always go, go according to plan. You know, outside of the people that were affected from a health standpoint, you know, you guys were affected more so than most people having to, you know, plan a day like this. But uh, I, I think the key thing to take away from this is that, just to remember to work together and then think about how you guys made it through this. And then if you can make it through this, you guys can do anything together. So just, you know, work together and, you know, be open and honest and you guys will do great. So um, with that, I wish you guys you know, nothing but the best and, uh, you know, cheers to the, uh, the new Decklemans. So. One of the best versions of Leah that I've seen over the years is the version that she is with Andy. Andy brings out the best in her. He's so sweet and caring and kind and funny. And obviously, again, he brings out the best in her that I've never seen them more happy. They say good things happen to good people and this is one of those days and these are two of these people. So if you join me in raising the glass to them, welcome to the family. Cheers.